revelation, Prince William celebrates huge achievement with a very special message. Prince William has impressive news to celebrate as his football team, Aston Villa, remained in the Premier League after a 1-1 draw with West Ham. The Duke of Cambridge retweeted a video posted by his favorite football team, which showed the players celebrating after the match. The team can be seen singing and dancing to the Neo Diamond's Sweet Caroline. Prince William commented on the video showing his support. He wrote, Never in doubt, up the villa, W. The Duke has been a fan of the club for many years and passed down his support to his eldest son. Prince William took Prince George and Princess Charlotte to their first football match last year. They watched Aston Villa play in Norwich at the Carroll Road ground close to Cambridge's home and Mahal. Aston Villa scored an impressive 5-1 victory. Prince George gave an enthusiastic goal celebration during the match. After the match last year, Aston Villa's official Twitter account tweeted you know how to pick your AVFC games, your Royal Highness. Photographs show Prince William in the stands alongside Prince George, Princess Chocolate, and the Duchess of Cambridge. Prince William spoke about the game recently as part of a documentary titled Football, Prince William and Our Mental Health. The Duke of Cambridge said he enjoyed a good weekend of football when he met with the heads of the Football Association, the English Football League and the Premier League at Kensington Palace. Speaking about the Cambridge's trip to watch Aston Villa, Prince William said, I wasn't celebrating, that was the problem. I was sitting with the home fans. George did my bit of celebrating for me. The Cambridge's were sitting among Norwich supporters and the club is close to their country home in Norfolk. Prince William documentary focused on the Heads Up mental health campaign. It followed the Duke for a year as he took his message to clubs across the country from grassroots level to the elite clubs and players. In the documentary, the Duke said, most men like football, involve themselves in football. But men seem to have a real issue when it comes to mental health and opening up about and being able to talk about stuff. And we felt football was a really good way to be able to reach some of those hard to reach people. To get them to talk about their feelings, to not let things get to breaking point. Prince George turned seven last week while the Cambridges have been isolating in Anne Hall due to the coronavirus pandemic. When the young prince turned six, he showed his love for football by proudly wearing an English shirt.